Alright, so I'm here to review some of the new brushes that I just picked up from Amazon. This is the case they come in. They kind of wrap around like that and they'll just tuck in there. Now this comes with quite a few brushes, okay? So you're probably not going to be able to see them all in this frame. So you got this big old brush over here and then it keeps going and going and going. Alright, so you get a total of about 24 brushes, if I'm counting correctly, who knows. Um, the first thing I noticed when I opened these is there is a distinct smell, and that smell is going to come from the plastic that is encasing um, some of these. Some of these just have like saran wrap, and then these um, bigger ones over here have like the plastic guard on them. Like I'll show you. So there's the saran wrap, and then the plastic that smells is this. All right. Yeah, it, it definitely does smell pretty. But here are the brushes. Obviously, if um, you know someone who's a big fan of green, personally, I like bright colors. I'm a big bright color person. I believe bright colors make you happy. Um, so I love, love bright colors. This might be a good gift for them. Um, so it's not too expensive for the amount of brushes you get. It comes with quite a variety of brushes. Um, I see a lot of eyeshadow brushes. Some of these seem like they'd be really good for um, a little bit of nail art, like cleanup and whatnot. I might make one of these for that. Let's see some of the others. It does come with a sponge. Now, this is something that some people might not like. If you can tell right there, these stray hairs. Yeah, that's not that's not pretty. They're like crimped and off to the side. You see those? Um, so that might concern some people. Let's see, what else? Got a few more that are a little bit stray. Can you see those? Um, other than that, like feeling the brushes, they feel super soft, which I'm not surprised about. Here's my first kind of no-no, if you can see it right there. Um, right there. Yeah, there is a big old, like, I don't even know what that is. Almost seems like glue, paint, wood. I don't know, but that's not very attractive now, is it? So, I don't like that. So, some things I'm looking for as I'm going through them are, like, the loose caps. There's always brushes that are notorious for just coming off. Um, so far, none of these are loose at all. That doesn't mean that eventually they won't fall off, but... Not an issue with any of them thus far. They seem pretty sturdy. Um, none of the brushes have issues. Now, the brushes are just like a normal wood. Like, you can hear it. It's like, think of your pencil that you use. Your number two pencil. Um, that's going to be what this is. It's nothing special. Okay, so there's another little dent there on the wood. I don't know what this is. It looks like glue. Can you see that right there on the cap? Alright, so I did want to point out, now that I've gotten this brush out, there's a little bit of glue around there again. Alright, so I went and got some of my more expensive um, eyeshadow brushes out to test along with this palette since I've never used it before. These are the ones that I'm assuming were better than these. And um, I've already played with them. You'll see the color on there. And I'm going to swatch them again for you and show you um, the difference. So... I actually don't notice a difference with the color payoff like I thought I would. Um, one thing I should mention though is this green set doesn't have your normal eyeshadow brush, which is this one right here, and it doesn't have a blending brush. So, you know, that might be something to consider. But let me go ahead and I'm going to swatch um, the blue for you guys because I think it's going to be the um, best uh, representation here. Now, if you'll see, that blended really, really nicely. It blends, like, right in. And then let me use the blue on this one. You're going to see it doesn't blend as nicely, right? Maybe after a little bit. Um, it almost seems like there is better payoff with the green, um, but you got to blend a lot more with these because they're a lot stiffer. Um, I've noticed that every time I've used it. These just, they blend like a charm. So that would be the difference as far as those go. Um, I'm going to show you some of these brushes again because I want you to understand one of the problems I have um, with this set now that 
I've compared it to my other brushes. I am impressed with the color payoff comparatively. I thought these would be a lot worse. But this comes with 24 brushes. My brush set upstairs comes with five. And if you see here, all of these brushes, yeah, they're the same shape and the same stiffness, almost like a concealer brush or um, maybe a crease brush. I don't know. They're all just kind of stiff, right? They're not going to be this poofy kind of eyeshadow brush. It's really, really good for applying color and putting it on. Well, that's how all of them are. They don't have a blending brush, and they don't have the eyeshadow brush that I'm used to. And the face brushes are the only poofy ones at all. <laughs> so um, that's a little bit of a disappointment to me. Um, all these brushes, and not really a huge variety, to be honest. Um, yeah, they're all pretty stiff. They do have an eyeliner brush and a lip brush and a contouring brush and whatnot. Um, and all those, but as far as some of the other main ones, they don't have. Alright, so I hope that helps you. I think it'd make a great gift, um, maybe to someone that's a collector or beginning their collection or something. I think this would be fantastic. Yeah, I don't think it's honestly probably going to be for me because I have my set upstairs that, um, I just like the brushes more because they're more what I need. I don't need all these, but... I think I will use a few for some things. It's a really great deal for the money. Comparatively, like I said, this set came with five brushes. It was probably twice as much as these green ones for all 24. So it's a great buy. So beginners, um, bargain hunters, sort of thing. Perfect purchase. Hope that helps.